Hey guys, it's Scott Bickle. Hey guys, just another video, you know. And today I'm going to be dyeing my hair. I'm trying to get this, uh, but I don't think it is that light and I've got roots, look. I'm gonna dye my hair. I know I should, I should be waiting, but I really think I need to do something about it. I'm not, might not leave it on for long. I might just leave it on for 10 minutes, because I'm thinking I want to go a little bit more natural sort of coloured. Well, not that much more natural, is it, really? It's the preferences. The head I'm using is L'Oreal Paris uh, preferences, and it's with a high shine extract. Uh, my shade is 10.1. Uh, it's a very light ash blonde. So I'm hoping to go a bit more natural. I was going to cap this in, but I'm just going to put it all over because it's a lot of effort to cap your hair. So you get a lot of instructions, but I've done this so many times. I know exactly what I'm doing with the instructions. So I'm the bitch on the box this time, and I know what I'm doing. So first thing, get your gloves. This is number two, this is the preference colour. And there's preference one, that's the formula. You get the conditioner, so you keep that to the end. So, first things first, and you get the little shine. There's the little shine you get with it. So, I'm going to start off by putting, mixing one and two together. The outcome will be, but at the same time, excited. So, yeah, just mix in. Number one with number two. And there goes your pinky blue. I'm gonna begin to shake it up. So you might want to do it in sections, but because I've got quite short hair, there's no real point in me doing it in sections, is there now? But I could just do my roots, but I kind of want to do it all, so <sighs> wish me luck, I'm actually terrified. And I'm not sure why, because I always do Let's get ready. Huh? You might want to get the underneath rootage. I'm like a moaning old hag at the moment. Oh god. You know when you just you feel really scared for no reason, that's how I feel right now. Scrabble just be a minute. Okay, now you've got most of the hair down on your front, so just sort of scrape it back. And I will show you guys in about half an hour on my head what sort of colour it's looking. So you can see the difference from what it was to what it's going to become. Okay guys, so I'm just in my dressing room now. And I'm going to show you guys the outcome tomorrow after I've had a bath and washed off all the excess and sort of straighten my hair and that because I'm getting quite scared and I don't want it to go grey and I don't want it to go ginger and it's, I don't know what it's doing but it stings and it hurts and it stinks and it's horrible and yeah it's making me feel quite sick actually quite at the moment so thanks for watching at the moment and You'll see where in this video whether I survive the night without being sick. Oh my god. It's kind of grey and white. I'll dry it until you know it comes out. Oh my god. Hey guys again. So yeah, I dyed my hair last night and this is the outcome. It's, uh, it looks very natural and very, it's like in the light, 
but this side looks a bit silvery or a bit just a bit more natural and toned. Like you've got rid of like the bright the brightness, but at the same time you can still tell that it's a bleach hair. But yeah, I really I quite like it. It's quite different, and I think this will be the start of something new and different to my hair. So yeah, that's my new hairstyle now, and I've used the preferences, preferences bowl. And thank you for watching the video, and goodbye. And if you want to buy the dye, just go to your local store, and it should be there, or it'll be online on the L'Oreal Paris website, which I'll link to the video. Okay, thank you guys, bye. Stinks, I promise you, stinks. That's a turn off of hair dye, it really stinks. Bleach, oh my god, it burns and it's sick and it's... But I do kind of like bleach.